When I was a little bitty baby, my mama would rock me, rock me in the cradle. Then, then, oh, got to feel back home. It was down in Louisiana, just about a mile from the Texas car. Them old cotton fields back home. Okay, you see how the curtain down here at the bottom is opening and it doesn't stay closed. So we're going to fix that with some magnets. So it's kind of dark in here. I hate it. Hopefully, I have this up high enough to where you can see it. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one pin, and I'm going to put them where I want the um, magnets to be, like that one. I probably, I don't know if you can see it or not. Okay, so there's one. I want it to go right here and make sure your pins are even. I want one right here, right here, so I'm going to put a pin. And then I want the same, I want to level it up here and put another pin right here. So pull this out. This. You see where I got that pin? I'm going to put another pin right here. Okay? And I'm going to go down to the bottom and I'm going to do the same thing and get so I got pins right here. <clears throat> this is where I want them to be at. So there I need a total of six magnets to put on this. So let's get our magnets and let's go put it together. Okay, I have the same material as us curtains. So I want to stick with it of course. I still got a pretty good lump here. This right here is kind of like on the side here. So we're going to start with it. So we just cut it completely straight off. Okay. Now if we have to go back to that, we will. But we're going to use, try to use this. Okay. Now these are the magnets. See how small they are? We got them at the Cherokee. So, okay. So I'm going to need a total of six. So, there's two, four, and six. Okay? Two, four, six. Seven. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to put my, uh, my little ruler is two and a half inches. And I'm just going to cut it like this, right here. And then I'm going to turn it around. I'll cut this one. Alright. Now, turn it around this way. And I'm going to, I think I'm probably going to get my scissors scissors. Uh, and cut that. There's that. There's that. Now, I am not going to worry too much about the sides of it because if you go and sew them down and all Oh, maybe we could. I don't see no reason why not. I don't know. <coughs> I think we need to leave them what they are. <coughs> we 
believe them like they are. I'm getting a sore throat and everything. We can't do too much to it. And all. Because we have the depth of the the magnet. I don't know if you can tell what I'm doing. But would, that would have to be a whole lot bigger than this. But I think those will work. I'm not going to go after Purdy. Okay? I'm just going to go after. Okay. So, let me get all this out of the way and we'll go get our curtains. I'm showing you the curtains right here at the top. See here how we got that rod in there? I'm using these right here. These are here for blinds. But this right here is so that it doesn't go out. And it's easier to take out of the the um, thing badoodler. So I'm going to lay that one back up in there. So that when I put the curtains back up in there, then I'll have it. Alright, let's take it to the sewing room. I'm backwards right here. And if we keep on going, we can find our pins. Right here is our first two pins right here. And they are kind of pretty well much straight. So what we want to do, we want to get two of these. Okay? We want to put, it doesn't really matter, pretty side or not pretty side. All they're going to do is just hold the magnets. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this one here. I'll take this uh, pin out. Line that up. I'm going to pin this one back down with it. Okay. Now I'm going to come on this side. I'll take this pin out. Keep it all straight. Don't let it go nowhere. Okay. And we're going to lay this one right here because we want them to make sure that the uh, magnets will clack together. Okay. Alright. Now, we have those. So now I've got two more times to do it. And this is not going to work underneath there. Alright, let's push it up. Let's go down here to our next pins. Alright, they should be... Okay, there's those right there. Up. Find our next pins. Right here they are. Let's level our pins up. Grab us two more of these. And we're going to line this one right here up with it. Pin it. The same with this one. Alright, now we'll go down to the next one. The last one, which is right here. We'll make sure I line them up so that they go right. Alright, here's this one. I'm going to do this one. That one up there and this one don't go off. Thank you. Okay. Now then the next thing we want to do is I want to move these magnets. Alright. Let's see if I can get you closer. <clears throat> Alright. The next thing we want to do is we want to sew a, this down because it's into like a pocket. And I'm not too worried about too much of it 
because you're not going to really see them <coughs> that anyway. So we want to make us a pocket here. So I'm going to start with this side, even though it is the, I want the outside because it's folded up here. I want to try to get it a little bit flat, you know. So, there we go. Oh, wait a minute. How in the world? Oh. Good gosh, I went the wrong way with it. I want this over here. Over here, this button here. I want it straight. That's not going to hurt it now. Going too fast. Alright, well, here we go with this one. Turn it around this way. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm trying to turn it. Get rid of that. Right, let's go through this way. There we go. No, we don't. Get it up here. Okay. Alright. Now then. Pull that up. Alright. Alright. Now we have this one right here done. Now let's do the other the other ones. We all we want them all with a pocket. See if you look at it. We have a pocket right there. And the magnet will go right in it. the magnet. Well, maybe. There you go. We've got the magnet in it now. Alright. So, we're not ready for them yet. So, let's uh, finish getting all these pockets on first. So, we'll be back. Okay. Now that we got our pockets done, don't forget the back stitch. The beginning and the ending. Because I think I'm going to have problems with that one because I didn't do it. Alright. Now, we're going to take our first one, our first pocket, we're going to grab a magnet, and we're going to, oh, this is the one that I messed up on, that I didn't backstitch on, ha, 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 alright, we're going to drop our magnet down inside there, and we are going to close it up, put him in there, close it up. I'm a little back stitch. There we go. Alright. Now let's put magnets in all of them. Then that way, when we get done, and we can see how it works. I got them hung back up there. Now let's walk through it. I'm going to put my hands right in the middle where the middle ones are and open it. Now you see, it went clamped right back together again. So I'm going to come out, we'll do that. And look, see, it comes on the bottom right here. But if you just keep on walking, it'll just take it right out. And clamp back, back together again. So I did my job on that. And I'm happy with that. Alright, well let mom check it out. Go. Now mom, you tell me what you think. They closed real good. I think they did real good. Mm -hmm. I'm happy with them. How about you? Yep. Yeah. Keeps the smoke in. Thank mm -hmm. you.